Hi, I'm Terence, the founder and CEO of Ride Technologies, Singapore's homegrown ride hailing app. Uh, I think probably hard work or genius. So, uh, there's this book by Malcolm Gladwell who talked about the 10,000 hour rule and he said that you know they looked at a lot of uh, people from different industries from actors, mathematicians, uh, computer programmers, uh, musicians and they found out one thing that those people who perform the best in their uh, industry have gained mastery have incredibly uh, spent uh, 10,000 hours perfecting their craft and that's approximately 10 years and so that's hope for all of us you know, who, if you put in the necessary hard work over a period of time we will be at the top of our game hard work you know i've been here slogging it out day in day out for seven years as an entrepreneur i'm getting there <laughs> to the 10 year mark i think it is uh, follow your passion uh, why right? i think it is a necessary but not a sufficient condition. So let me explain. Right? So we are always looking for to pursue our passions as an entrepreneur, as a business person. I think that's a necessary uh, a point. But at the same time, we need to be cognizant that uh, we also need to understand what the market wants. Right? So we shouldn't be building things just based on our uh, passion. And uh, you know, if we want the business or whatever they're working on to succeed, you also need to be solving a problem you know, in society and making sure that what we are building here, uh, there is a market need. Yeah, there was once a driver actually recognized me and he was uh, really, really happy because he has been uh, driving on our platform for four years and never met anyone from right. So, you know, I was the first person he met he recognized me and uh, you know he really thanked me uh, you know shared with me his stories you know thanked me of how uh, you know he has been driving for the last four years you know and we have helped him put two children to school you know and feed his family and especially during the pandemic you know um, you know that really uh, the additional income really helped him to get through a difficult time so that was a very touching story and at a point in time I realized that you know what we were doing impacted the lives of many people. So normally, I am a quiet person. Firstly, because uh, you know, I want to give the driver some space and I normally don't want to tell the driver which route to take because I think he's a professional driver. He knows the roads better and the traffic conditions better than me. And of course, uh, I also want to have uh, good ratings from the drivers so that I can uh, get cash back. <laughs> no, 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 uh, I've traveled each and every highway and more, much more than this. I did it my way. Or Frank Sinatra. Frank Sinatra. <laughs> I hope I didn't know that I sing out of tune. <laughs> okay.